Hey guys, and welcome back to the update from The Lighthouse. So it's been about two weeks since the last one, didn't do one last week. Um, not too much has changed, honestly. Uh, yeah, not really. So, World of Warcraft Battle for Azeroth came out, been playing that a lot. Uh, trying to figure out what I want to make videos on it about. Uh, I feel most of the niches are pretty well carved out. So I'm trying to think of something I could do. Uh, BDO, I'm trying to sort of slow down the number of BDO videos I do per week. Um, I don't, I do currently between about four to seven BDO videos a week, and I'd like to keep that to the lower end, about four, which would be patch notes, uh, week in review, a Saturday video, and some other random video. Uh, apart from that, what else has happened? So, the remastered showcase happened. Uh, Mail Ranger was confirmed. Uh, new graphics and music, all of that. That was pretty awesome. Uh, level cap is increasing. Not not really increasing, but uh, they're raising the soft cap slightly, which means they should be raising the level cap soon enough uh, by making 63 even easier as even doubling how easy it is to get from 62 to 63, people start, still aren't going to do it just because it is an incredible grind right now. Uh, apart from that, still have the cooking video that I'm making. Uh, it's going to be a shorter video. I'm trying to focus on shorter videos, like not shorter videos as in shorter videos with less content, but not rambling as much as I am in this video right here, or in videos like uh, Choosing Classes Right For You. And yeah, just uh, not much is going on. Honest, I'm a little burned out right now, so I mean, I'm trying to take it slow, not burn myself out too much more, and just sort of play games, uh, just do some normal gaming for a bit, and then I'll come back with a fresh uh, take on it. Still playing BDO, still playing World of Warcraft, still playing Magic the Gathering. Uh, it's just, it's difficult to both create videos and play games and work all of the, all of them. It's uh, it's difficult. Um, it's also difficult because I'm sort of trying to improve the quality of my videos. Like all the things that I've done to make my videos better since I started the channel, uh, they really start to add up after a while. Like after I do the audio, I'll usually scrub the audio and then I'll normalize it. Uh, after I make the video, I usually throw it into the rendering into the program I use, DaVinci's Resolve, and I do a few things with it there, uh, make thumbnails, I've got a tag system set up, I make actual descriptions now. So all that sort of, sort of adds up, and where I could used to make, like, for example, this Choosing Class Start For You, I'd make that 20 minutes, uh, and then I'd just post it, throw some tags in, and choose a cool screenshot from the, uh, from the video itself. Uh, so maybe 25 minutes in total. Now this this took about two hours to make. That's not like it was anything amazing. It was uh, fairly average. But uh, yeah, it's, it's getting more difficult to make stuff and try to improve the quality at the same time. So I'm, I'm trying to find sort of a middle ground there. Uh, the next Let's Play should be coming up soon. Uh, let's play The Economy Black Desert Part 2. So Part 1 was on the event-based economy and especially focused on the supply for boss or boss level accessories and other uh, sort of rare items in the game, mostly enhancement materials and accessories. Part two is going to focus on demand. So quick hint, it has to do with pen items. So for those of you that uh, dislike my thoughts on enhancement and how I personally think it should be made a little easier, uh, you're probably not going to like this video. but Stay tuned, it's not just me saying it should be easier. There's actually a very specific argument I have here that uh, I personally think is one of the main reasons the BDO economy is the way it is. Uh, hyperinflation notwithstanding, because hyperinflation is no fault of the enhancement system, that is totally the fault of uh, currently sea monster hunting. Before that, it was payouts. Uh, really, it's just Pearl Abyss not caring too much. Apart from that, for BDO, uh, cooking video, I mentioned alchemy video, still in the works. I've got a video on grinding. Someone else did a video at grinding Wandering Rogues recently, and I'm like, damn it, they're revealing my secrets. But that's also the video I'm currently working on, 
which made it kind of awkward, so I decided not to finish it for Sunday and instead to wait for next week because I didn't really want to uh, be accused of plagiarizing, even though I've had it in the works for a while, and anyone that watches the channel knows that I love Wandering Rogues. Uh, but yeah, so that's uh, that'll be coming up next week. Hopefully it should be this Saturday. Uh, I work a bit less this week, but still working quite a bit. And yeah, also going to be making some WoW videos, uh, probably mostly on gold making. And pretty much I'll, I'll stick to gold making for now. Gold making is something that uh, I'm fairly proficient with, and it kind of carries over from BDO. don't really want to expand into anything else, as that would sort of be splitting my attention in too many different ways. Uh, Mad the Gathering Arena, I've got a deck tech video coming up, as well as the next video on how to play. And yeah, so apart from that, uh, one second, let me kill the display for a second. And I can show you guys sort of what's happening with the channel itself, analytic wise. All right, so here you can see the views for the last 28 days. Um, you can really see the last week or so it's kind of suffered because I didn't post any videos. Well, I posted a few, but I didn't post that many videos. Um, yeah, it's, uh, eh, it is what it is. Real time, you can see it's about 20,000, 22,000. And that's only because we're coming out the weekend where I posted uh, a pretty good video on Friday and a pretty good video on Saturday in terms of what people want to watch. Uh, people are very interested in level cap increases and class that's right for you. So one thing I've been considering for Black Desert recently, uh, so like I said, I want to sort of tone down the number of Black Desert videos I do per week and sort of becoming more, less of a guide channel, and more of a news channel. Uh, so one of the things about Black Desert is, as everyone knows, I'm trying to expand it into other games while sticking with Black Desert. But I have made most of the guides I need to make for Black Desert. There's obviously still some guides I can make. Um, individual class guides are a big one, but individual class guides in Black Desert are difficult. There was someone that made a comment on one of my recent videos complaining about how I don't play every class and how they just want someone that plays every class to uh, create videos. But the problem with that in Black Desert is it's not really possible unless you absolutely know life it. Because playing every class requires a lot more effort in Black Desert than it does in other games. Um, yes, some a lot of the skills carry over and armor carries over, but getting relevant weapons is still very expensive. And leveling up is still very difficult in Black Desert compared to other games. Uh, not so much difficult, just tedious, I suppose. It's not like leveling in Black Desert is difficult. Leveling Black Desert is easy. It's the same thing over and over again. What's difficult is doing that same thing over and over again for tens and dozens of hours. So, sort of transition more to a news channel. I'd still do one guide video a week, so Saturday would probably be a guide video or an opinion video. But Tuesday video, keep with Week in Review. Wednesday video would still be Patch Notes, because that's what uh, Patch Notes come out on Wednesday. And then... Any other news that comes out during the week, cover that, as well as a single guide or opinion video a week, uh, would be my guaranteed Black Desert videos. Um, I feel I'm pretty decent at news. I'm usually fairly up to date on anything that's happening in Black Desert. A lot of my videos about new things coming to Black Desert or things that are changing in Black Desert get pretty good views. So it is something I am considering. Unfortunately, the channel would take a hit while I'm doing that as... Well, uh, news videos, like opinion videos, news videos only really give views right off the bat. Uh, so if I look at the last 48 hours here, and sort by most, uh, with the exception of this one, this is, this is an interesting opinion video because uh, it's always relevant to people, and for some reason it's continuing to do really well. But news videos, they're usually only relevant within about a week to two weeks after the release. Uh, like As I scroll down here, you can see there's no news videos here. Um, there's The only one is the patch notes from literally the other day. And the two that are released, or the one that are released on Friday. Everything else, nothing news videos. And I suppose BD Remastered, but BD Remastered has concerns the future of the game. And that's not even a news video, that's just showing the new, the new footage. So, yeah, um, it's something I'm considering. Uh, the Discord isn't super lively, uh, and 
Guide videos take a lot more effort to make than news videos, which takes away from me trying to expand to other parts of the channel. Uh, other games for the channel, rather. One of the things I'm most hyped about because I, that I really want to make guides for is Smash Bros. Ultimate. Uh, unfortunately, that doesn't come out until December, so it's going to be another four months. So in that time, uh, try to expand into WoW and try to expand into Magic and keep on making news videos as well as a single guide video or pin video a week as guaranteed. Now, just because I'm saying only four videos a week doesn't mean I'd only do four videos a week. Uh, guaranteed does not mean only. I could also still do Let's Plays, still do other random videos. And speaking of Let's Plays, so something I haven't been able to do very much recently that I feel really bad about is I haven't been able to stream. Uh, I've been really busy. I've been going to sleep really early, like 10, 11 p.m. So that means I haven't been able to stream recently. Uh, I'm hoping to remedy that starting tomorrow, so Tuesday night. I'm going to try and do a stream. Uh, probably about like 5 or 6 p.m. Eastern. It'll be Black Desert. And yeah. Uh, so yeah, I don't really want to br sort of drag this video out too long. But that's sort of what's going on with the channel. Uh, it's difficult to make consistent videos every week. I probably put out the most videos of any video YouTuber. As a lot of people are aware, my videos are somewhat lower quality than other YouTubers. Um, like Dungeoneers, but he releases like a video every month and a half, so I'm not super worried. Uh, and also, the other thing is, it's kind of demoralizing. When I put out like a video that I personally think is really good, like Classes of Black Desert, and then it just doesn't do that well. Like if I click on it, one second, kill the display. Uh, go to overview. Bring back the display. And draw all the way back out. So you can see Class of the Black Desert. Like, yes, it gets over 100 views a day. But other class videos get, like, over 1,000 views a day, like other co content creators. And uh, I really feel, I, like, I put a lot of work into this. And it's kind of, people say, oh, if you just improve the quality, people would enjoy it more. But when I improve the quality and spend a lot of time working on these, it, they don't necessarily get more views, actually. In fact, most of my highest viewed videos, uh, so one second, go back to the video manager up here. Do, 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 do. Shut my neck a bit. So yeah, so most of my highest viewed, viewed videos actually do not have much editing or much in the way of sort of like fancy stuff or high quality editions. Um, just from the top, first ever video done with a headset microphone where a little bit for an hour and 10 minutes I walk around and talk about things new players should know for BDO. Uh, there's no real editing for this one. Uh, I do have a good script for it and it's got a really nice thumbnail, but that's about it. No real editing for this one either, just me talking for 26 minutes. Guide to the Dark Knight, uh, so this one I did have to put actual effort into. There's an actual video that goes with it, decent audio. Could be way better audio. I do have a new microphone, but I don't really want to remake it because this is like one of the Black Desert, the Dark Knight guides. So I don't really want to uh, cut into its views. Uh, how to make money? It's got a decent script. Uh, I need to not remake this, but make a more in-depth version. But the problem is the non-in-depth version already is already 15 minutes long. So yeah. Enter to the lawn, uh, just me talking with the lawn for seven minutes. When to switch, this is like the most random video. This is a video that I made. So I guess the most random one is this one actually, but this is a video I made because it was late at night and I was trying to think about what I should upgrade my accessories to. And I was like, oh right, upgrading from a Sula set. So I made the video. This is just footage of me enhancing from zero to try. Uh, this is... I'm not gonna count this one. This <laughs> this was a this has gotten like a view a day after its first like 24 hours, uh, and then you finally get to one that's actually decently done again. AFK fishing, but yeah, most of them are literally just me talking with uh, f relevant footage in the background. So this is the first one that's actually got good editing. Well, not good editing, but decent editing. Uh, a really good script, like really in depth script. 
and a really nice thumbnail. And as you can see, it's only got 35,000 views, which is barely more than the free duo crescent ring. So yeah, so a lot of players, people, or not a players, uh, a lot of viewers say just improve the quality and uh, you'll get more views. But it's not necessarily that simple. Uh, a lot of YouTube has to do with luck. A lot of YouTube has to do with uh, the algorithm, which we can't really see. And it's uh, it's difficult to have videos sort of blow up, even when they do have good stuff. Like uh, part one, I would consider this probably one of my best videos I've ever done. Uh, the class of Black Desert part one and two. Uh, lots of editing done. These each It took me about two days each for me to do these part one and then part two. Uh, sewing it all together, getting all the transitions correct, getting all the audio correct, and uh, it took quite a while. But yeah, so yeah, drawing transition more to a news-based channel for Black Desert. I uh, still do a, some guides and some opinion videos, but don't I don't want to try and pressure myself to do as many as I've been doing right now, uh, especially because I would like to expand into other games. Apart from that, yeah, stream. Uh, there'll be a stream tomorrow. Uh, should be probably about like 6 p.m. Eastern time, somewhere in there. Uh, it will be on YouTube. I won't be on Twitch. I'll be on YouTube. So uh, just watch YouTube. The notification will go up. Uh, topic of the stream. I'll probably be talking about what the Let's Play topic will be. I'll talk about it more in depth than the Let's Play will go into. As the Let's Play will be more of a general overview of it. Let's Play I'm going to try to keep around 30 minutes. Stream could probably go an hour or maybe even more. And yeah, so that is what's going on with the channel. Just still making videos, still cruising along. Uh, super busy recently, been burnt out. And yeah, uh, comment below, join the Discord. I'd really like to try and get the Discord more active, but part of the problem is me. I don't really comment in the Discord all that often because I keep weird hours. And as a result, uh, the Discord isn't super active compared to what it'd be. Anyways guys, uh, thanks for watching, and have a good one.